Let's talk AI before I have to go make dinner. And babes, we need to talk. There's so much noise on the internet right now about how apocalyptically bad AI is for the environment. And no, I'm not saying that AI is great for the environment because the evidence shows that it is not. AI is technology. Technology is a very resource intensive, fossil fuel heavy industry and that creates pollution. Climate change is a real problem that needs to be solved. As consumers, we also need to understand this. So to put things into perspective, a single chat GPT query is about 0 0.0003 kilowatts of energy. So if I scroll social media for an hour, that's the same amount of energy to run about 330 to 660 chat GPT queries. To drive a mile is about 1,100 chat GPT queries. If I want a scoop of ice cream, glass of milk, any single serving of dairy, it's about 5,000 chat GPT queries. And if you want that hamburger, it's 12,000 and for a plane ride, I can only imagine. So what is it that we can do as consumers? And that's to be more mindful. And yeah, if you choose to abstain from AI, that is your decision, just as it is for someone to abstain from eating meat or dairy or go completely vegan because of their belief in the environmental impact. So for any of us feeling guilty or thinking more deeply around kind of the environmental impact of using AI, we absolutely need to think about it. We need to think about it in nuanced ways in terms of how we can offset our overall usage, not just with tech, but with food, with how we transport ourselves. All this to say, don't give up on AI quite yet because I'm not also ready to give up ice cream.